Virtual reality is the creation of a computer-generated simulation of a three-dimensional environment where users immerse themselves into the environment and interact with objects, manipulate their way around the virtual world, and also understand how these objects work in the virtual environment. So this process of immersion relies on various equipment, such as we have the headset, we have controllers, we also make use of a screen and also the base station. Naseni Virtual Reality came about as a result of the advanced manufacturing technology mandate to practice innovative technology and methods that would enhance and improve competition in the manufacturing sector. Well, the virtual reality lab of this agency offers so many benefits. Uh, in the case of the agency itself, it has two uh, development institutes, the National Engineering Design and Development Institute, where they make engineering designs of all the products that Naseni is going to produce, while it will be taken to Prototype Engineering Development Institute in Elisha to develop the prototype. Now, the virtual reality serves as an intermediary between these two institutes, thereby cutting cost of producing the prototype. These trainings for virtual reality is rare to be found in so many countries because people are not willing to share that knowledge. And if you want to do that, you have to pay exorbitant amount of money to gain that training. Now with the equipment and Naseni's uh, virtual reality lab, this opportunity can be used to outsource training to other countries, thereby generating revenue to the country. There is need to be uh, software developers, hardware engineers, multimedia and graphics designers, as well as communication engineers to work hand in hand in order to come up with virtual reality content. And uh, the training they require is in line with the content creation as well as simulating multiple models, either engineering or science as the case may be.